I'm Michelle Salt, 33 years old and a Paralympic snowboarder. So June 27, 2011, I was on my motorcycle. It was a beautiful day. I was going up a hill, 120 kilometers an hour, and I hit a guardrail. I laid down my bike. This 500 pound machine was pinned on top of me. I hit the guardrail head first. Did cartwheels in the air, hit the guardrail again. Upon impact, I broke almost all of my bones in both my legs, bilateral compound, tib fib fractures, my hips, broke my back, shattered my pelvis. Uh, right clavicle punctured along, bruised my spleen. And when I broke my right femur in two places, it severed my femoral artery, which is the second largest artery in your body. I was transported by STARS, which is our life flight. I lost 28 units of blood, which is three times what my body holds. I um, went through five surgeries and life support for seven days in the hospital for five months. And of course, my right leg was amputated quite high above the knee. So normally when you sever that artery, because it's such a big artery, you bleed out within 10 to 15 minutes. I lived 23 minutes, but they lost my vitals three times. And the third time they lost my vitals, I had a full out of body experience. I was looking down at my broken body, knowing that I was in trouble with this horrible gut feeling that I was gonna die. And it was in that moment that all of this strength came to life and I consciously made the decision to be here today and to live and to say I love you to my family one more time. I wanted to make the most of it and so I decided very early on, the day after I came off life support, that I was going to be a Paralympian. I knew I needed a goal to get myself through the really tough days and those days were dark for sure, but that goal got me out of bed every single day. We all go through something in life, and I often have people say, oh, well, I went through something, but it wasn't nearly as bad as what you went through. Well, that's not true, because we all have trials and tribulations that define us. We all have challenges that make us into resilient, strong people. So never downplay the hard things that you go through. Never compare them to anyone else, because those are your story. That's what defines you. When I first started taking a C redox, I noticed that my, again, my recovery was a lot quicker. Um, I didn't ache as much. I didn't hurt as much, which allowed me to um, be more active and to continue to train even when I was getting exhausted. Well, I find that Acia Redox helps me with my recovery, um, my lactic acids. I don't feel that burn or that ache as much in my body as well. For me, it gives me energy and that bit of boost that I need in order to um, you know, train well and quality training throughout the day. It has allowed me to go from being the very bottom of my category to being a 16-time World Cup medalist. And that's because I have the energy to stay on snow. I have the energy to power through long wait times and you know crashes that normally take me out, put me out of the race. But now I have the recovery needed to get back up and keep going.